how do you exfoliate the skin underneath your beard? In this video, we're gonna take you step by step through the best way to exfoliate the skin underneath your beard. But before we jump in the shower and go through it, let's quickly cover a few items. First off, why should you exfoliate the skin underneath your beard? Well, if you have beard dandruff or beard itch, or if you have a buildup of gunk in your beard or your beard just isn't as fresh as you'd like it to be, exfoliating can help. Now, when it comes to your skin, if your skin's looking tired or dull or kind of uneven, um, exfoliating really helps to rejuvenate the skin and bring back that bright, youthful appearance. And of course, it does that by removing dead skin cells, by removing that grime, that grit. Uh, now, there are two types of exfoliants. They're chemical exfoliants, which are acids, and they do what acids do. They dissolve dead skin cells. Now, if you have facial hair, since beards are made of dead skin or made of dead cells, we probably don't want to be dousing them in acid. So we use an, a physical exfoliant in our charcoal sugar scrub. As the name implies, we use sugar, and we found that sugar is the sweet spot when it comes to greediness, but also it dissolves quickly in the shower. Now, if you've ever used like crushed shells like walnuts or um, rocks like pumice in an exfoliant, you know that those can really get tangled up in your beard and can be a bit of a pain to wash out. So we use uh, sugar in our charcoal sugar scrub. We found it's just the right amount of grit and it washes away. You don't have to worry about having you know gravel or sand stuck in there. Um, it's just great all around exfoliant. Now, let's get started. All right, first off, wet your beard. Now, you can exfoliate in the sink. I prefer to use the shower, it's just easier uh, because it does require a bit of rinsing. Um, so first off, Lukewarm water, get your beard under the water, let it soak. Uh, if you use some wax-based or petroleum-based beard balms, things like that, you might wanna up the water temperature a little bit just to help loosen and soften uh, that gunk so it's gonna uh, wash out easier. Uh, now, the reason why we say lukewarm water generally is because if you use hot water, it can over dry the skin, which can lead to beard itch and dry skin, and flaky skin and things like that. So normally you wanna use lukewarm water. Now, once you have your beard nice and wet, uh, bust out the product. I use about a quarter size of our probiotic charcoal sugar scrub. Now, of course, this is gonna vary on personal preference and also the length of your beard, so just kind of experiment with it to see what works best for you. Now, once you have the product in hand, go ahead and rub it between uh, both uh, hands, your fingertips there, and then start gently massaging it into your skin uh, using a circular motion. This is gonna help ensure that you properly exfoliate all aspects of your skin, all areas. And then also in the beard, I like to try to do that circular motion as best I can, but really get in there going from root to tip to help break up any beard care products that might be in there, any pollution, any gunk grime, you know, some spare food that found its way into the flavor saver. Uh, so just really gently work that into your beard. Um, now when it comes to pressure, you know, just a light pressure, this is a physical exfoliant. And since sugar does dissolve, you're not gonna cause too much damage, but you don't wanna muscle, you don't really wanna scrub in there because you can cause microabrasion. So just a gentle circular motion and you'll be looking good. All right, so now that we've washed it out, time to get out of the shower. After you towel dry, it's important that you apply a daily facial moisturizer. This is gonna help optimize uh, the, your grooming routine. And if you're not using a moisturizer, we'll have some other videos about why you should be doing that. Uh, but apply your daily facial moisturizer. And then if you use beard oil or beard balm, go ahead and apply that on after. And that's it, pretty simple. You can get that done in the shower in a, you know, less than a minute, um, but you will notice results. It's become one of my favorite things to do when my skin looks tired after a long night, whatever, just like use a scrub and uh, looking refreshed and renewed. Now, if you have any questions, comments, go ahead and drop them below. If you found value in this video, please give us a like, consider subscribing. And also I wanna know, do you currently exfoliate underneath your skin or beard? And if so, what's your favorite exfoliant to use.